Welcome back everybody to Let's Play Star Fox, moving on to Fortuna. Fortuna. Fortuna, I'm gonna call it that. This one is not easy. It's very hard. The planet Fortuna. Endros has taken control of the huge creatures who live on the Fortuna. On the Fortuna, yes. Take care, Fox. Good luck. And right off the bat, get out of the way. Uh, the first time I played this level, I just smacked right into it. I'm like, whoa, where'd that come from? I was like, not even paying attention yet. Because usually it gives you a few seconds on these levels. Okay, so first off, these bees. They are extremely annoying. You have to make sure you keep hitting them. You gotta kill them. Otherwise, they'll just buzz around you and keep doing damage to you, and it's really, really annoying. And they will kill you. They will kill you pretty easily. Uh, I think they turn from blue to yellow to red, I believe. And once they're red for too long, they'll charge in and just buzz around you. And it's not fun. They do quite a bit of damage for such small little creatures. And just make sure you hit those dragonflies as well. And uh, they'll fly away. It's kind of like in Sector Y with the... Uh, manta rays and uh, so focused on these bees that <laughs> I uh, just totally ignored everything else nice change in the scenery the music on this level always reminded me of like a casino it's kind of one of those or like uh, the casino night zones on like Sonic the Hedgehog or something that's what this music reminds me of. The cool nightlife kind of music. And you definitely want to save your buddies here because... Um, well, actually, to my amazement, like I, my jaw actually dropped. But I, I saved um, Peppy one time. It wasn't Slippy, obviously, because he wouldn't do anything. And he shot down one of the birds, and I about started crying, because it was such a miraculous ordeal. <laughs> I should probably talk about these Hydra things. They pop out of the ocean, and they have a tendency to shoot you a lot, and it's very hard to dodge. And like a pro, I accidentally hit... Uh, I uh, break again, so I just kind of danced in front of them for a good five seconds while they beat the living crap out of me. So once again, try to save them. You can destroy those hydras. And, uh... That was not cool, and a bit of the on there. Uh, you can destroy the hydras, and in some cases you kind of need to, otherwise they'll just keep shooting at you from behind, and there's no really any way you can dodge it that I've found. Like you, even if you hear it coming up, you can't really get out of the way, and I'm taking damage left and right here. Make sure you get this laser upgrade. You'll need it. The boss. It makes it so much easier, and I'll explain why. Can I get the help? Yeah. Remember when I was playing this level, um, I kept going like, "Oh God, oh, move, move out of the way!" Because so many things just kept popping up in front of me. With this, you want to immediately get out of the way. Stay low, stay as far to the side as you can, or else you'll trample all over you. And as Peppy just said, you want to shoot the tail when he's running this way, and when he's coming at you, you want to shoot uh, his two heads. If you notice the tail, it kind of gets like a bump that uh, moves along it. That's uh, when the those little things get to the end. He shoots out an egg, which um, hatches a bird when it gets about halfway to you. They're easy to dodge, and for some reason the boss like glitched off off screen or something. And so I'm just waiting here, waiting for him to recenter. I'm like, okay, well, I guess I'll just kind of try to hit him on the left here. The whole time I'm just like, 
holding the left button, trying to shoot him, and he kind of repositions himself here. He like skipped a phase this time though. Normally he'd, he'd run at you again, and then he, uh, he'd, he'd only do this after you, you hurt his tail. He'd run at you, you'd have to get down to the side, and then you'd jump back and sit down again, and you have to get off to the side again. And it's a pretty hard boss fight, but if you know what to do, he's pretty easy, like I just showed you here. It's not too bad. Uh, don't be intimidated. Pretty easy. The, the level, though, that is quite a challenge. You'll have to definitely hone in on your uh, dodging skills, because there's so many things to dodge. So many things in the way. It is looking good. Sixty-three percent. Meh. I don't really care. <laughs> Still got four lives left. Well, five, I guess, because zero is a life. But, uh, yeah, we'll tackle Sector Z next time on Let's Play Star Fox. See you then.